Hey guys. Hello from Epcot and Festivals of the Holidays. Welcome to the holidays. So excited for it. What are you excited for today? Just uh Chip and Dale merch and Christmas kind of decorations, Christmas cookies, Christmas food. I don't think we'll do the cookie thing. That's a lot of cookies in one day. Or do you want to do it? You I wanna... think it's like you don't have to eat them like right now. If they come if they come packaged, that's even better, right? Right. We'll see. And we're gonna show you uh the festival merch and all the pretty decorations. I'm so excited for Christmas. I love Christmas decorations. Even though as we sit here right now, it feels like it's, it's 85 degrees. It's so hot right now, right in the sun. Last weekend in November, it is steaming. But I can see some cute decorations, so let's go see some let's more. Go oh, I see Donald. Let's I go see check it out. You know what one of the best parts about today is? The magnets. Magnet. We're gonna get some Chippendale today for sure, but for sure it's gonna be magnets. You think so? Yep. So we at least got something, Chippendale. Like your like psychic abilities. My psychic abilities. We were gonna get Chippendale something, so we might as well start out with the magnets, right? Gotcha. Look at that. One big magnet, I guess, or you could cut them out. Or it looks like they might, yeah, they they pop out, or you can keep them like that. Pretty cool. All right, I see Chip. Where's Dale? Maybe it's just Chip. Chip Nutcracker. Maybe Dale's more popular. Maybe. Ooh, I do like that shirt. I'm in love with the shirt. It's adorable. I see Ashley has found them. That's probably my favorite spirit jersey. And it's got the most on it. The only thing I'm I'm upset about. What? I don't like. I don't like that. You don't like the way that is? I don't want it on there. I don't want to date it. I don't want to say oh, the date. The so you know what's good though? I can't even read the date. <laughs> but I can. You that's, can. That's yeah. All I can see, like that's the only reason why I don't want to get this. What about this? Little cookie jar. That's adorbs. Twenty four ninety nine. Again. Dated. No, just I just I mean I understand it's for your festival, but I just don't like it. Like I just want Chip and Dale merch. They need more Chip and Dale merch. Let's look at some more of this merch. No, I didn't. Oh, I like this one too. Some more of the cookie jars. Oh, look at these mugs. Twenty-four ninety-nine. I didn't see the. I was just looking at the thing. I didn't even notice the purse. Oh, it's over here. Let me get this. That one would fit your phone. I'm gonna, it's a test. That one, I think, that one would definitely fit your phone. Do you yeah. think it's gonna make it to the character warehouse? It might not. It depends actually, on how many they made. It, it actually, actually fits, fits your phone. phone. But is that limited to a certain time of the year? Well, yeah, I mean, that's fine, though. So, yeah, if you got it, you could use it for another month or so? Yeah. Uh, is that Chip? I see Chip and Dale behind you, too. And there's Dale. That's uh, She has that on. Look at her sleeve. Isn't that adorable? That's adorable. But look at this. Oh, they're not attached. Oh, they are. Oh, they are. Somebody broke them up. I should have worn my festival shirt from last year that I had. You forgot all about it? How much are these guys? This is what we saw earlier, or the other day in the uh, warehouse, but they had the Halloween ones. They only had one, and somebody got it. Yeah. Pretty cool. I didn't see how much they were, though. You didn't read it. I can't read it. $29.99. $29 oh, wait, I found. There's Dale. There's Dale. 
can't forget about the Dale. Yes. Oh, look at they got ornaments too. Well, I like the ornaments. $24.99. $24.99. And they dingle. They got some bell ornaments. <laughs> when you first held them up, I was like, those are some jangly earrings. Like, dangling. I could wear them. Yeah, you earrings. could. And they have some pass holder stuff too. Where? <laughs> pass holder merch. They're so cute. $27.99. Oh, look at these. <laughs> More ornaments. This pass holder ones? Yeah. Um, pass holder, yep. $24.99. $24.99. As you can see over there, Starbucks is no more. It's all torn up. Club Cool, all that stuff. Changes are coming. Oh, that's cute, huh? $49.99. We bring the Mary. I like that. Dated. It's not dated. 2019. Oh, dang it. Come on, you know, I, I, you know, it's cool. Have some of the merch, but don't date some of it. All right, we'll stop complaining about this. That's just, that's always been, I think, our pet peeve, having yeah, stuff dated. Socks are the um, food socks. Cute. They actually, if you go inside of Mouse Gears, they have some of those out. Um, this is... Socks. Oh, That's a great stocking stuffer. Yeah. $19.99. And speaking of stockings, how much? They are 30 bucks. What do you think of the tree? I love it. I love how it says happy holidays in all the different languages. And at nighttime, it's beautiful. This has got to look, I, I'd like to see it at, yeah, at night. Come back at night time it won't be this video, but we will see it at night. Look at the angel on the top. Look at the angel at the bottom. I don't know for sure. We'll do one for Chippendale. Chippendale for, sure. for Chippendale, for sure. Yeah. Stocking stuffers. The yummiest time of the year. That's super cute. I think it's always the yummiest time of the year here. Is that a Christmas train? Oh my word. It's 139. 139? Only. Only 139, but you do get a pass holder discount. If you're an employee, you get an employee discount. If you're a DVC, you get a DVD, DVC discount. The good old holiday cookie stroll. Purchase any five cookies from the Holiday Cookie Stroll. Locations here. Make sure to collect a matching stamp for each cookie you purchase and bring your stamp festival passport back. Complimentary, complimentary cookie and an ice cold glass of milk. It's pretty cool, huh? How much are the cookies? Probably two or three bucks, at least. Here's Feast of the Three Kings. It's not open yet. Feast of the Three Kings food. Pastelloni. Queso fresco stuffed arepa. Cookies two fifty. Arepa. Cookies are only two fifty, huh? I just think I'm hungry. I'm hungry too. Where do you get the book for the cookies? You get a book. All right, we found some more information on the cookie yeah, stroll. Yeah, this is the festival of the holiday passport. Of course, everything you need for it's in everything here. Everything you need to know about all of the. Um, it even shows the merch yes, I love and it. the cookies. But we were interested in the cookie stroll. And you have to purchase five. Purchase five. You don't have to purchase five of the same one. Any five, yeah. Any five. You can double up on it if you don't like one of them. And it Just was how much was the cookie on the thing? Two twenty-five. Two fifty. Two fifty. And at the very end, you get a complimentary cookie with a little glass of milk. And this tells you where all the cookies are. All the different are. cookies. 
So I think we might try that. There's only six different cookies, but you have to have five. Right. So if there's one you don't like, just don't get that one. You think we should try it? Well, Festival of Three Kings has a chocolate crinkle cookie. What are the other ones? Um, Bavarian Holiday, a Lin Linzer cookie, a ginger gingerbread cookie, of course, the black and white cookie, peppermint pinwheel cookie, and the complimentary Santa Santa Mickey sugar cookie, which is at the Holiday Sweets and Treats. So, so I guess you have to get all. What did he mean by you? Get if you, there wasn't one, you don't, you don't have to get it. No, they just stamp that you get a cookie. Oh, okay. So you can get like two. You can get two stamps? Right. Okay, that makes sense. What a beautiful day. So you got the chocolate crinkle cookie. Yeah. Let's go check it out. I'm thinking it's just a regular chocolate cookie. The with first some... impression is nice and soft, so that's yeah. good. I don't like tough cookies. No. Very chocolatey. Tastes like a brownie. Does it? Very good. How would Bob feel about like it though? A, like a crunchy brownie. A crunchy brownie. Ooh, look at all the. Don't breathe in the powdered sugar. Now I'm afraid I'm gonna breathe it in. Don't do it. It's like a brownie. It's very good. It's good. Success. In the Mexico, they have this. Horchata cheesecake. That looks really good. I seen uh, when we walked over there, somebody was eating one. Oh, Ooh, a fruit punch, good. holiday cider. And you get that right here. <laughs> so for the Mexican pavilion, the La Cantina has some Christmas decorations up, but the Mexico pavilion the does not have any, outside. yeah, poinsettias. None on the outside. They might have some on in the inside. Friends, imagine it's Christmas Eve. A hey, de a hoodoo, a hoo da 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 da. The farmer brings the goodies for the animals. Go, you! <laughs> he says, eat up, little piggies. Oh, and secret, what do the hungry Norwegian piggies say? Nuff, nuff. <laughs> do it again. Nuff, nuff. That's right. Now, from here over, you're all my hungry Norwegian piggies. Let's hear you say, nuff, nuff. Do it again louder. Nuff, nuff. Even louder. Okay, that's enough. Enough. <laughs> see, what sound do the hungry Norwegian cows make? Ma. That's right. Now from here over, you're all my hungry Norwegian cows. Let's hear you say. Ma. Oh, very nice. And the piggies? Ma. And the cows? Ma. And the piggies and the cows all together. Ma. Keep it going. And see, we'll think it's a farm on Christmas Eve. Lots of noise. Oh. <laughs> Stopping. Very good. Um, that was pretty cool. They're doing the uh, yeah. traditions That's from right. Norway. Pretty cool. I like to hear all the different traditions. I walked up on it and she was just standing there. And I'm like, she's not paying any attention. No, she was part of the story though. Yeah, I didn't know she was. They, they have the times listed in the guide, and they also have them out where the little stage is, but it's so cute. Yeah, you gotta stop and check out everything when you're walking around. So we're gonna check out the Shanghai kitchen. We're gonna get a Mongolian beef bun, but they have uh, street fries, barbecue pork, pork and vegetable egg rolls, along with the drinks. It's different. I was thinking it was... Uh, Were you thinking like Sloppy Joe? Well, it, it's called... It's called a bao bun, right? Yeah. I was thinking of, I was thinking of the, uh, like they have it, like they have it Pandora. Oh, it's Japan that has the, uh, the other ones. This we had during food and wine. It was my favorite because it had the uh, chicken and shrimp in it. So I mean, China Pavilion has become like one of our favorite stops for all the festivals. It's like a go-to for us. I'll let Ashley try it first. Is it spicy? Is it a spicy beef? No good, so I should like it. It's very good. Mm. You know what's wrong though? It's so tiny. I only got one. I know, that's what I'm saying. Like, I could have a bunch of them. Yeah. Win for China. Bavarian Holiday Kitchen potato dumpling, pork schnitzel, cheese fondue, black horse. We're here for the Windsor cookie though. But this is a cookie. A cookie. It's got some type of like raspberry maybe filling in it. I think it, is it raspberry or strawberry? Oh, maybe strawberry. It's got like two cookies. All Ready? Right. She's gonna try it. 
I thought you were gonna eat your glasses, you were so hungry. I'm hungry. I know I like these type of cookies. I've had my fair share of these type of cookies. The cookie itself has a... Gingerbread? Christmas flavor. Yep. It's crumbly, huh? It's actually very good. You're gonna really love this one. Oh, I know I will. Oh. <laughs> it's crumbly. He hasn't said anything, so it must be good if he's not saying anything. I like it. So far, we haven't had a bad cookie. No, not at all. Another win. This is, look how cute this is. When you get the cookie, the stamp is actually the cookie. We didn't do this last year, so this no, is we our didn't. first year doing that. How fun is that? We watched Jim, more sunshine please, his video of it last it's year. so fun. So I just realized we're actually going in order. We've gotten the first two, and our next one will be the gingerbread, then the black and white, then the peppermint, and then the complimentary Santa one. Yeah. Cool. So I don't know if I've gotten every one of them so far, but I want to check out Tuscany. Bianca Nev, Genovese, Barilla, Mel, a bunch of stuff I can't pronounce right, so I'm not going to butcher it. Looks good though, huh? Why don't they just call it pizza? I wonder what this means. Cookie credit, maybe? No, that's it. I mean, that's it's specialized. Special for this holiday, maybe. This holiday? I think all of this stuff would be specialized for the holiday, right? Yeah. This is a Tuscany holiday kitchen, so they're all. Hol See, it's got it here, too. Yeah. We will find out what the gingerbread means. Italy is definitely decorated for the holidays. Plus, when we were walking up, I had a very good whiff of pizza. I'm like. <laughs> I was, like, I was thinking of what we're pizza. eating today. That's like the best pizza. And I was thinking, is there any way we could fit their pizza in? I can. Because that pizza is fantastic. I got room like right on this side of my stomach. Huh. I'll just keep pushing mine out. It should work. <laughs> I meant my stomach, not. I don't know how that came out. Yeah. It did. I'll be honest with you, I was expecting this to be more festive. It's still under construction. This that side. side's under construction. That's going to be a barbecue place. A tree, yeah. But we're going in to see if they have the gingerbread like they had, uh... Oh, Liberty. <laughs> Voices of Liberty. Well, let's go check them out. I came over to check out the gingerbread as Ashley is waiting for Voices of Liberty. Nice. Wish I can convey how good this smells right now. Here come the voices of liberty. Slow roasted turkey, hand carved smoked ham, chocolate pecan tart, and a gingerbread cookie. We're gonna go with the cookie. Oh, yeah. 
Thank you. My goodness! Look at the gingerbread man. So we just got to hear one of my favorite things at the holidays was the singing. Voices of Liberty. Voices of Liberty. The it's holiday. awesome. And I mean, you can't have a. I'm holiday. keeping. I'm keeping Gingy in my shade because it's hot. Oh I don't no. want him. I don't want him to melt oh, before no. we get to him. Keep expecting him to talk, don't you? I'm gonna go first head. All right. No, it's really good. It's a very gingery. Mm -hmm. Not too much, just right. <gasps> oh no! Oh snap! Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's really gingery. It's really good, isn't it? Though. Mm -hmm. So far, there hasn't been one we haven't liked. The first one, or the one that had a gingerbread taste earlier, what was that? Germany. Germany. This is gingerbread. Yeah. The other one was more Christmas. Yeah. That's good. Santa and Mrs. Santa Claus over there. For the record hunt, I don't see any decorations in Japan. No Christmas decorations. Let's see if they have some, some holiday food though, maybe. Were you going to say something? I was going to say. Uh-oh. So they do have a holiday kitchen, New Year celebration soba. Chirashi sushi tree and matcha creme brulee. Ashley said she has to see what the pictures look like, so let's go see. Look at the sushi tree. Oh, that's cute though, actually. I probably wouldn't like it. That's what they got. Now we'll say, la 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 All right, let's see what this holiday kitchen has. Pastrami, smoked salmon, potato lakis. That one, ah, black and white cookie, that's what we're gonna get. Also, this is over here to the left is where they do the uh, Hanukkah story. Thank you. You're welcome. Look how cute it is. It looks like it needs to be drawn on, like a face or a snowman or something. I don't think that's the, the theme of the game. I know, though. but it looks like it should be, right? Let's go find a table. Okay. So Ashley's going to try it first. You're just trying one side? Yep. I don't want that side, though. Because, you know, I don't. I like the white chocolate yeah, more than dark what chocolate. I just thought about. I was actually going to get a little mad if you ate just the white side. <laughs> that's very good. Is it? Is it really? Thick. Uh -huh. Ooh, it's lemon. Yep. Oh, I like that. I like it too. Nice and refreshing. It feels like a meal. Like if you started off with these, I don't think I'd be hungry by the end. We're over in the France area and they're doing that show. This show makes me so nervous where they stand on all the chairs. Like I can't I can't watch. I can't do it. That's what makes Ashley nervous. She always thinks they're gonna fall. March the Knoll Holiday Kitchen has a uh, bunch of stuff I'm not going to butcher. Let's see if they have the pictures. Salmon spread with house made bread, turkey and mushrooms in a cream sauce. Yeah. That looks like cruise food, doesn't it? it looks good though. We're getting ready to walk in the UK area, but if you come back back here, you can meet Father Christmas. We join him and sing along. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Happy Holidays to all. It's going to look cool when Mary Poppins is in here, huh? I'm excited for that. Yeah. <laughs> so is that guy. <laughs> really excited. He heard Mary Poppins and he just he just let it all out. <laughs> We've made it to our last stop on the cookie stroll before we get the final one. 
Yukon Holiday Kitchen. Some salmon, Canadian wild rice and ham soup. Sounds good. Peppermint pinwheel cookie. We're getting that. But look at that maple. Look at that. I might have to get that. Ooh, Ashley's already in line. This is it. This is the last cookie before the final cookie with the milk. There you go. Thank you. Peppermint pinwheel. I'm not a big peppermint person. I don't think you are either. So I don't think I'm going to like this one. Nope. <laughs> I think a hard pass that on them. the fastest no I've ever heard from you. <laughs> I just don't like peppermint and like believe that. Believe me guys, I've heard a lot of no's. That was so disgusting to me. I mean, if you're a peppermint fan, you'd like it. That's a whole lot of peppermint. Well, I like peppermint it's not even pieces. A whole lot of peppermint. It's a weird peppermint. I think it's because you can tell they use like the oil peppermint. Yeah, out of all the five we've had so far, mm. this would be number five. But it was two dollars and fifty cents. I feel like I have to eat it. Not a fan. Here's the last one: holiday sweets and treats. Ooh. Hot. Cocoa sounds good, but it's a little too warm for it. The first one There's the last one. I think that's probably the cutest one, wouldn't you say? This is actually bigger than I thought it was yeah, going Yeah, actually, be. I thought it was going to be half that size for a milk. That's not bad. Not bad at all. Asked. Oh, it's, it's in the 80s today. But yeah, I could see it. That's some hard chocolate. But you look at it melting off the plate, though. Like, that's a whole piece of chocolate. For, just for you. Just for me? Yeah. All right. Mm. Is it good? I'm going to take a piece without chocolate, just for me. Nice snap. It's okay. It's getting packed here though. That's a lot of chocolate. <clears throat> I thought I liked it. You wanna bite this? Yeah. Thanks, Dale. I had a good time. As you can tell, the air is cranking because we get a car and it says 87 degrees. It's almost 90, Tomorrow's December. It's almost 90 degrees. Oh, MG. But we had fun. Um, there's so many festivals, so I feel like so much money to go around to all the festivals so i thought the cookie thing was probably it's pretty good bargain it was only yeah. 250 per cookie and then you get all of these like super cute stamps i mean it was fun yeah plus this is the shortest festival it's it only goes festival. from uh to like december 30th right i just feel like we're always in a festival at epcot like otherwise it's diet epcot there's hardly ever a time and it's, walcott now with all the walls know, in there it's not that long but all of the countries, I mean, most of them had up like garland or just simple. Japan didn't have anything. Simple decorations. Yeah. But if you're, I mean, it's good to go and listen to all the traditions. I like to do that. I like yeah. to listen to Voices of Liberty sing that they're a special Christmas edition. Father like, Christmas. Then they also have a Hanukkah one. And what else? I like that it goes into like a little more of the story instead of just like gifts, you yeah. know? Like it's a, it, it gifts are good though. Gifts are good, but it tells you like the true meaning of Christmas. Giving gifts is good too. <laughs> and we got to see Eva and Dan. And go fire design. Oh my gosh, I I just love it when we get to see them. Yeah. And we we didn't show them or anything. I think it was I like know. two hours later we were like, oh, we. I know we talked. They had to get so going. Long. We had to get going. It was so nice. So um, I actually have one of their shirts on right now. The stitch you stole Christmas. So we'll. And I felt bad because I didn't have one of their shirts. Oh no. One of the few times I don't have one of the... So we'll put their link in there. I yeah, mean it was it's always nice to see them. Super nice. They get our, our more my sense of humor. They do. Dan is like Bob. So. Yeah. I mean Eve is, Eve is probably like me too yeah. so it's really they're really cool. And I also like to say um, got these ears from Sola Break the Magic. Um, we'll, Instagram. Instagram. We'll uh, put her link in here. Um, With a code to get 10% off. Right. So if you mention Bash 10, um, you can get 10% off. And these are super cute. I love this bow. This velvet bow. 
so cute so so cute um the merchandise was undecided about the chip we and we forgot fail. the salt and pepper shaker but i've seen them here so i knew they'll okay, be here before they'll be here. they'll be here again but i was just so undecided about the chippendale spear jersey because you look at stuff now and you're like is that going to make it to the warehouse is it going to make it to the warehouse but you know i think i might go back and, i mean if we come back i might get it so undecided because it's so much money to spend i know that would be my actual like, first spear i just wish on I and i think uh eva agreed with us that on it's cool with the holiday merch you should have some that don't have the dates. Right. But I get it. I get so what they get you to buy another one the next right. year and it's, all. But it's a great marketing. For them, yeah. Yeah, great marketing. Um, had so much fun at Epcot. I mean, we love Epcot. Yeah, it's one of our go-tos. Right. It's now I'm, I'm ready to go home. <laughs> You're ready? It's hot, yeah. But we do. We know there's several. Ready to get something to eat besides a cookie. <laughs> right. We know that there are several videos. Um like this out there we do appreciate you stopping by and checking this checking out. us out i don't really think you stop by though you just check us out um uh, make sure you leave whatever a, you do right? we appreciate <laughs> it we appreciate it uh, make sure you leave a comment we enjoy the interaction we really just appreciate you guys so much we hope that this helped if you can't get to the parks bring a little bit of christmas spirit to your bring a little to disney you. to your town yeah but thank you guys so much don't waste the day every day's a gift bye guys bye everybody so we are getting done Bags packed to around the run today We're really on our way